Hello everybody, this is Diane from Diane's Diamond Painting Journey, and how are you all doing? Are you all ready for Christmas? Because I'm not. Nope. Got the tree down from the attic. It's now in the garage. <laughs> it's not up yet. <laughs> and this is uh, early in the morning on the 16th of December. Well, I'm hoping to get this is uh, technically Saturday now because it's two o'clock in the morning. Yes, I'm a night owl. Hoping to get it all up on Sunday. Christmas gifts are bought though, pretty much. So that's not too bad. So I want to say hello to all my subscribers, old and new. Thank you for being here. Love you lots. If you're new here and you like what you see, because we're going to do a post review now. I'm like two weeks or more overdue doing this one. Um, if you like what you see, you can hit that like button and leave me a comment because I love reading your comments. And if you really like what you see, you can hit that subscribe button for me. Yay. Help my little channel grow some more. I can see some cat hair on the back of this beautiful canvas. Dear God. Molly's in the house. So what do we got today? Hang on, it's a, it's a big one. Ah. Good God, look at that through the camera. <laughs> this is one you wouldn't expect. The, the, the art. When I'm going to tell you the artist, you, you're going to be like, what? If you never saw my unboxing, if I remember, I will put it up in the eye. This is Coral Castle by the one and only Randall Spangler from D Diamond Art Club. And there's not a draggling in sight. Oh, and before I forget, if uh, down in the description box, <clears throat> if you've never ordered from Diamond Art Club before, you can use my code Diane10. You'll have to look in the box and see how it's uh, spelled, like caps and stuff. Um, and 10 would be 10. I had to get 10% $10 off your first order. If you choose to use it, thank you very much. Any uh, percentage I make will go back into the channel. This, you're looking at, um, this was probably, it's absolutely confetti heavy. But to tell you the truth, every section had so much stuff in it. Like you had the fish and the bubbles and can you see the bubbles? Here's the bubbles. Like the bubbles going blah, blah, blah. And like you had certain things to focus on that you didn't care about the confetti. Wonder, I'm going to see now. One, two, three, four. There were five ABs in this. Now, and one I, I did it for an event that was called Sparkle. It is well, still going on. Actually, I'm doing another one now. Uh, Sparkle Addictions. And um, so you had to use another AB or something. But for whatever reason, with his kits, certain kits, I can just go crazy with it. And I don't plan it. It just happens the way it happens. I put one extra AB in the shells of the two turtles here. This one you can see better because there's fishies going past this turtle. For all the bubbles, now I'll take you closer up after. For all the bubbles, I used a drill that's called the bubble drill. And it's a flat drill with just a bubble, no facets. And um, the top of it is actually see-through when you get the color. The color actually comes from the bottom. I put that in there. I put in, um, there's a jelly drill somewhere, a jelly crystal. One of these orange ones, maybe. Um, there's two or three metallic drills and uh, metallic crystals in here. Oh, this green, this green is metallic. And then there was some brown metallic. This I know that's up there for sure. Uh, all together I use 29 extra enhancements. <laughs> uh, 
I had that many bags of stuff that I didn't know what to do with myself anymore. <laughs> and didn't plan for that to happen. All right. I was going to just put a couple things in. But like each group of fish, you see like this fish group is different from that one in the middle. This one in the top is another one. Then you got these three like surprised fish in the middle. I decided to make the whole mermaid, except for her flesh and hair, crystals. Although I think there's still one AB in her. And then the coral, I added all kinds of crystals to the coral. Now the small fish... I didn't do anything with them, but each fish has got a crystal eyeball. I put extra crystals down here. That's why you see like these really bright spots. There's some, no, there's A, B's and that. A, B's and that. There's crystals in these, that group of fish. There's some crystals in this group of fish. There's some crystals going over the bridge. This group of fish here got crystals. This one got his own different crystals. This fish didn't. Oh, no, I did a little bit. And uh, I didn't do the brown um, brown ones, the brown coral. I didn't put any extra into the stingrays, and I'm going to call that a big dolphin. These look like two whales down here. I didn't put anything into them. He says it's a good thing. And, like, there's crystals in here, there's crystals in here, here, here. And with the castle, um, there were some blue ABs, like, in the stripes stuff here. Like, I'll show you this more up close. And some yellow ones to light up the, the windows or whatever. But the, the a lot of the blue AB, I think it was, I don't know, it was 101. Let me see, I can tell you. Yeah, 101. A lot of the blue AB was in the bubbles. So I wasn't using it. So I went, okay, so then I put blue ABs, outlined all the turrets. All of them. There, and this one right here. The only one I didn't do anything with was, like, what was framing the door. Because the door is going to the bridge, see? So, what can I say about this canvas? Absolutely freaking love it. I didn't have very much trash. Uh, the drills were really good, even though this is a last year's canvas. So, let's see. Now, let's see. It's heavy. <laughs> so, like, you can see the, the purple crystals. Uh, where are we to? Some green here. There's some yellow here. Oh, these are jellies here. Oh, there we go. Um, see the little round drills? So that's sparklers for squares. I use two or three of those. So this is a square canvas, but it does have some sparklers for... Now, all these enhancements came from uh, Tina, Tima, Diamond Painting with Sparklers. So they're sparklers for squares, and they actually... They're small enough to fit... On a square canvas. That's what they're made for. See all those crystals? Let's see now. Oh, this. Like, I don't know what to show you. Look at the crystals in that one. I actually took crystals out of that because it was too much, I thought. And like, this guy's got ABs and crystals. This one, I just. It's just the ABs that were in the kit. This is heavy. Crystals in the coral. I loved all that. And these are the these are the jelly crystals. Difference in the jelly drills and the jelly crystals is that the jelly crystals have a backing on them. The jelly drills, I have them, but you can see through them. And so you got to be really particular where you use them. Because otherwise you're going to see um, the symbol is the word. Oh, look, here's some... Uh, right now... Can you see these brown here? That's a metallic brown. The blue. Now, I didn't change colors as such. Uh, crystals there. Let's turn it this way. Oh, my God. This way is done. I'm going to go to put it up on the wall. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, that's not going to work. Yeah. So we got our... Uh, can I fold it? I wonder. Hopefully I can. So we got our mermaid. So I gave her uh, a crystal tail. I blinged her right out. I said, that poor girl is not going to be down there. Like I stuck with the colors that they wanted. But now it might have been like a different color purple or whatever or pink. And her, her top. Now, can you see these bubbles? Is there any way I can show you that, I wonder? I'm trying to show you that they're actually raised off the canvas. Like, you can feel these. See how that's sort of raised off? Yeah. And they're round. Now, they're taking the yellow. Hang on now. Or they're taking it off. The, they're actually blue, but it's taking the light from the... A flash. Sorry. Words. And like you can see the blue crystals, uh, ABs here. But see they're in here in the castle to make the make the turret look like it's going around. But I uh, outlined the whole darn thing with it. Look at the crystals here. And again here's the uh, sparklers for squares. The S for S, she calls it. And put crystals in the green. And here's the other metallic. So let's see right now. Okay, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Wait now, I'm looking. I'm looking for something to show you. Oh, actually, that's a sparkler for square there too. That's a pineapple, I think I called it. I think it's called okay right now all right so this is your normal crystals all right so they look like crystals but now this one you can actually see the metallic right don't mind my gaps got bad eyesight all right you can see the actual metallic man I'm gonna need the when I hang them up, I usually hang them up uh, on the well, on the wall, certainly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'll just cut off around the washi tape, and that's my frame. And I'll put some thumbtacks in the top, usually three or four, but I might have to put five in this one because it's really heavy. And then I just put, uh, you know, like your poster putty, uh, on the, so much on the sides and on the bottom to keep it stuck to the wall. But... I, I'm impressed with myself. I'm sorry. This might be the most complicated yet uncomplicated kit I ever did. It didn't take me that long to do. 18, 19 days, I think. You know, I, I wasn't at it straight, but. And it's just that I dug out my stuff and, um. Uh, my crystals and stuff, because I got tons of them. And um, I, I just started with the top fish, because I, I started at the top. And I said, I'd like to change one color, you know. And that's what I did. Well, this one, you can see it brighter. And around the bigger fish, now all these small ones, and like those small red ones right there, and these right here, they just got the crystal eye, like eye, like everybody else got, 939. But, uh, and there's some um, metallics in these guys too, the brown ones. It was metallic chestnut, metallic jade. So this was the jade. And, um, of course, if you look on my Instagram, um, I actually posted it up and I, I posted up the written pages, two written pages that I wrote out to uh, say what I did with it. But I just couldn't stop myself because it just is the kind of canvas that leads you to want to do something to it. Even though, I mean, he did this beautiful canvas, but it's just like I just wanted to change out some things. And I never thought I'd use that many, though. Like, I did not. No, I had not. I never planned on using that many. 
But I think, you can tell me what you think. Did I overdo it? Did I go crazy? Like, I wasn't going to do the whole mermaid, and then I went over oh, to heck with it. I'm doing it anyway. And uh, except for her flesh, certainly, and uh, her skin and uh, her hair. And, um, and like, it was just a light brown AB in, in top of the shell here. Oh, that one feels like it's not down quite. That's a me problem, not a canvas problem. Because they did fit good together. And maybe we saw it gapping because I was, the way I was holding it. They did fit really well together. And there was, well, really very little gapping. And now, too, using crystals, they're a little bit different size. And uh, some like and the metallics I found were a little bit smaller than a normal drill, and then sometimes you get some crystals that are a little tiny bit bigger than a normal drill, and um, so you just sort of got to play around with it. But uh, I can't say enough good stuff about this canvas. And like I said, it wasn't uh, not older, but it came out last year, I think. And um, well, I mean, she has over a year old now. But I didn't have any problem with the drills, like the squares were good, the sticky was good, as always, the symbols. I don't know if there was one or two symbols that um, were tricky for me, but I do have bad eyesight. And I don't use the light pad as much anymore because it seems to give me a headache. Um, so if I can avoid using it, I will. So there you go. Run the, oh, I got a, something there. Just, oh, I got to look at it afterwards. I didn't put it in there right for sure. Uh, so I, I'm not sure if it's still available. I think it might be, though. But So if you want to try Randall Spangler, it's a 70 by 70, yes. And you don't like his draglings. There you go. Have at it. Because it's absolutely beautiful. The colors, oh, my. I don't know how many colors were in this now. I can't say. Oh, yes, I can't. 59 colors. There you go. 59 colors, five ABs, and a whole crap load of extras. <laughs> All right. I'm going to let you go. I hope you like what you see. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. And uh, we'll see you soon. Oh, i got to tell you one more thing. If you're still here, um... I got asked to do a Christmas premiere. Uh, the Diamond Painters do Christmas premieres and put them up on uh, Christmas Eve, um, Christmas Day and Boxing Day for us to 26th. In uh, Belgium, it's called the second Christmas Day. And um, uh, somebody was unable to do their video, so uh, someone put my name forward and um, they asked me if I'd do one. So my time slot is Christmas Day, 8 a.m. Central Standard Time. That's, you know, for the States and Canada. So 8 a.m. Christmas Day, Central Standard Time. So what will happen, it goes up as a premiere is what it's called. But what it is, is like a whipping chat, but I, it goes up as a live. And I'm actually in the live with you, in the chat. So anyway, I haven't got that fully made yet. We're going to finish that off tomorrow. And um, I hope uh, some of you can be there to see it. If not, you can watch it in the replay and uh, see what silliness or whatever I got on with. And, uh, well, I hope to see it here in the chat. Who knows? So I hope you uh, I hope you stuck to the end and heard this. <laughs> All right. Loves y'all. Here's a big hug. And we'll see you soon. Bye.